one of Vlogtober 2021. Um, my name is Robin. I am an indie dyer just outside New Orleans, Louisiana, and it's currently about nine o'clock in the morning. Uh, I am dyeing some Winifred Sanderson today on Soft Sock and probably some Binks because I'm working on the Hocus Pocus orders. And I'm also in the process of doing all my packaging this morning. So I'm gonna send out the tail end of the mystery skeins from last week well as hopefully the first few of the, Hocus, the first few orders from the Hocus Pocus pre-order that are ready to go. So that is what's on the agenda this morning and this early afternoon. I'm going to take a little break later and play some more Animal Crossing and I finished my sweater last night which is super exciting. So I need to weave in the ends on that and then I'm going to block it. So I will show you my blocking process. It's not really anything exciting. Um, I am going to try a new wool wash, which is kind of exciting. I ordered some from Sorella, uh, some of their Taylor Swift collection. So I will show you that, and then I will show you uh, my blocking process, which I think for this cardigan, because it's so drapey, I'm not going to bother to pin it out. I think I might just lay it on the mats or lay it on my drying rack. I'm going to see see how I feel once it's, once it's wet and ready to be blocked. So um, that's what's on the agenda for today. We're going to go back to my parents because we are in the thick of Advent season and we have three days left, three days left to package, which is really exciting. I'm very, very happy that we're almost done. So we're going to do those and work on the uh, progress keepers today. And I think the plan is to start the Advent calendar packaging on Sunday, the 20. Third, I had to think about that for a second. So that's the plan. They have to all be out by the 31st. So that will give um, Larry plenty of time to pick a couple of days next week and kind of sprinkle them across the post office in our area. So that's what's going on today. I'll try to get some more footage of Pearl and Presley and Audie for uh, for this video because I know that you'll like them. And later today, I also need to upload last the, the fifth October video. So that's what's going on today.
October day 22. I had to go look at my calendar. It's Friday. I don't have an update today, but I do have a ton of work to do. So the first thing on the agenda is to skein up and package, like um, wrap up, like a little burrito, the um, full skeins for the advent calendars. Tomorrow is the day that we're putting them together, hopefully. So that is on the agenda for today. I've only got about 70 to do, so that's not too bad. We're just gonna try to knock them out. And then I'm gonna finish putting together the treat bags. In the dye pots today, I have, oh, the first couple dye lots of Christmas Tree Farm, which is very exciting. I've kind of had to tweak it a little bit. The last time I dyed it, we lived in our rental house and the pink that I used to get those like kind of purpley pink speckles leans a lot more pink with this dye, with this, um, this city's water, whatever, whatever water system we're on now is not the same as at the old house. So I just have to reformulate it a little bit. Those are gonna go up for pre-order on the 29th, 29th, yeah, Friday the 29th, so next Friday. Uh, and then just a quiet day at home today. I'm gonna try to knock out um, the last couple of the Hanukkah, ca Hanukkah calendar colorways and then put together the advents. And if I have some time, I'm gonna sneak in a few rows on my new sweater that I started yesterday. Welcome to uh, Vlogtober day 24. I haven't done any sort of talky talk segments the past couple of days because it has been just wild lately. It's been so hectic. We um, packed all of the advents. We started with the soft sock yesterday and then the day before I had a massive dying day and I got so many orders out and I just haven't had a lot of time to film things. So I'm going to put today's video or today's footage in with the last video and hopefully that'll help bulk it up. I like keeping them about 20 minutes. So this morning I have in the dye pots the last Hanukkah colorway and then I'm gonna dye some amok 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 and some black flame candle. That is what's on the agenda for today and then we're gonna go back to my parents house. Um, my dad's birthday is the 27th and we're doing his little birthday celebration with family today. So while we're there I'm gonna pack the uh, the shimmer advents today I think and I'm gonna put uh, shipping labels on the ones that we did yesterday so that is the plan for today usually I try to take days off if I can um, I die every single day I don't know if, if you noticed but I do I die every single day I don't take day I die days off because I'm working with a single burner or one or two burners I usually work with one burner so I can only die 
literally one colorway at a time. I prep like 10 of them, and then throughout the day I put one on, take one off, put one on, take one off. Um, but all that's gonna change whenever I get a steam cabinet, which we're supposed to call the electrician this coming week. So hopefully once we get that installed, I can start taking some dye days off. It's not a, it's not a big deal, it's just one of those ways that it has to be. And I like dyeing yarn, so it's not a big deal. So that's what's going on this week. Um, tomorrow I'm gonna drop Miss Audie off. She's getting spayed. I'm a little nervous, but every animal I've ever had has been spayed and nobody's had any complications. So I'm sure she'll be fine. It's just gonna be a challenge to keep her still for a week and a half, two weeks while she recovers. So that is what is on the agenda for today and this coming week. And let's see what else I get up to. October day 25. I am sitting in my driveway right now. I just got home from dropping off Audie. She is uh, getting spayed today and I'm pretty nervous. I really, I miss her already. I, I'm not as worried about the procedure because I know it's a, it's a very routine thing and dogs get spayed all the time and every pet I've ever had has been spayed. So I'm not worried about that. It's just, she's very, she's very skittish kind of. And I'm worried that she's gonna be scared and I'm worried she's gonna be nervous. I know she's gonna be fine. Um, but we have an Audi free day today, so we're gonna try to get a lot of housework done. Uh, the goal is to deep clean the floors, like we're gonna like disinfect everything real good while she's gone. And then I dyed the, what did I do last night? I did the last, the fourth colorway of the new collection and it looks amazing. And I used a new blue dye, which is why my hands kind of look a little blue today. So I'm going to dye a little bit more of that today. I'm going to do some Christmas tree farm for Friday's uh, pre-order and then uh, maybe the fifth colorway. I'll work on the fifth colorway today. I did run a couple errands. Um, I, I stopped at Home Goods because that's kind of one of my go-tos and I'm not feeling great. And I got some good stuff. I got Audie some treats and some toys for whenever she comes home. And then there was a new little tea shop that was next to the Home Goods. So I stopped in there and um, I got which one I got. I got the almond biscotti maybe, but it's just like a little like tea on tap, like a fresh brewed sort of thing. So I thought that was pretty cute. I got some footage of that, so I'll show you. But um, I'm home now. I'm going to uh, get some yarn soaking and I'm going to get started on dyeing for the day. <laughs> 